If you are one of the 80 million Americans who's losing their hair, fighting it is often a losing battle. Most of the time, conventional treatments like Rogaine and Propecia simply don't work. Tonight, CBS 2's Dr. Mike Rosen takes you to London to show you an alternative hair loss treatment get could be the breakthrough you've been waiting for. 29-year-old Rupert Silver sees his future and the truth is bald. And you're always trying to hide up, hide little patches. But I guess if I could have my hair, a full head of hair, it'd be lovely. A full head of hair is exactly what London doctor Chris Nulia says he can give him. Not with creams, pills, or surgery. You'll feel a bit of heat. But with this high-tech electronic wand. So the hair shaft grows thicker, stronger, and faster. It's called capillary regeneration, an experimental new heat treatment that Dr. Nulia says can stop hair loss and start new hair growth in up to 80% of patients, double that of conventional treatments like Rogaine and Propecia, already drawing lots of media buzz here in London. Doctors hope it'll soon come to America. It is a major advance. It is a major advance. In this painless 20-minute treatment, an electronic probe passes heat into the patient's scalp, allegedly awakening dormant hair follicles and strengthening existing hair. These before and after photos supplied by the manufacturer show dramatic results after just a year of treatment. There's less hair falling out. Londoner George Herbert was so traumatized by his hair loss, he even resorted to wearing this toupee. But thanks to capillary regeneration, soon he may not have to. After just a month of heat treatments by Dr. Nulia, George says much less hair is falling out, and new hair has even started to grow. I'm quite satisfied. So how does it work? Well, researchers say most cases of baldness are caused by a combination of genetics and an excess in the body of a hormone called DHT. Now, Rogaine and Propecia work by blocking DHT from getting to the hair follicles, but results are mixed. While 60% of patients report less hair loss, only about 30% of patients report new hair growth. Dr. Nulia says capillary regeneration is twice as successful because it improves blood flow around individual hair follicles and flushes a lot more DHT away. At $70 a pop, treatments aren't cheap. Like Rogaine and Propecia, capillary regeneration requires months, even years of ongoing treatment to see results. But some experts are skeptical. We always like to see scientific studies before you can really evaluate any new technology. Columbia Presbyterian dermatologist Dr. Bruce Katz says until there's scientific proof that capillary regeneration helps grow hair, there's no way to know if its benefits are real or imagined. If this treatment does what they purport it to do, this would be a huge phenomenon. One that experts say could revolutionize the billion dollar hair loss industry here in America and give guys like Rupert the coverage they crave. I'd like to be able to decide whether to grow it or keep it short or maybe to choose a style. That would be amazing. I'm Dr. Mike Rosen, CBS 2 News.